Hello everyone, this is Fareed Rumani and once again welcome to the third episode of Ignite the Spark Self-Development Series. So today's topic is Emotional Intelligence. How is Emotional Intelligence helpful in today's entrepreneurship or freelancing economies? So what is Emotional Intelligence? I think we have also made some previous content on it but in easier words, Emotional Intelligence means understanding your emotions as well as emotions of others. There have been a very famous say that fake it until you make it. Uh, these were need of the time. But as science changes, knowledge changes, things advances. And now people say rather than faking up and making up, understand your emotion, where your heart is, where your energies are. Some days your energy is not very much favoring you. That day you might need a break. That day you might need a holiday that day you might need to switch your interest to some other passions or hobbies or might need an away day off uh, and uh, Malali has said that you know don't force your heart because they go blind so sometimes when your emotions are not favoring you it's better to take a pause take a break rather than forcing your heart second thing in emotional intelligence is uh, creating empathy with others. Now, what is empathy? There is a word which is sympathy, then there is a word which is empathy. Sympathy is sympathizing someone. It's more a reactive term. While empathy is a proactive term in terms of listening others. Now, why listening others is so important is because in this fast moving world, <clears throat> everybody has an agenda, right? Everybody is so busy, so occupied. People really don't have time selflessly to hear each other uh, and everybody is smarter enough to realize is that why the other person is talking to them. If you remain in touch with your friends, your peers, they know it, but ad hocly if you get in touch with them and that's okay, you are a smarter person who doesn't show off in first day the need of the time, but eventually people will realize why this person contacted me for a while. This is against the law of emotional intelligence. So that's why keep on talking to people, keep on listening to them. That's okay if it's for a smaller time, build quality over quantity, but develop a habit of listening, listening to your spouse, listening to your family, your parents, your employees, your employer, your clients, everyone is happy. I know it's very difficult to maintain that but that's the second law of emotional intelligence which helps successful people in corporate grow and then the third more important thing is how to develop those emotional intelligences by practicing some quick exercises and a lot of exercises uh, if you browse on this topic but two quick things which usually have been repeated twice is one is meditation and Robin Sharma says 20, 20, 20. So 20 minutes of self-awareness a day, 20 minutes of walk or healthy exercise and 20 minutes of reflection. His, his book 5 and Club Shows is very high, which is built on 5,000 plus successful athletes, NBA, basketball, celebrities. He has coached. So 20, 20, 20. So I hope this helps you. And uh, we'll continue that self-development series for entrepreneurs and freelancers. Uh, maybe anybody gets sparked up and helped. This is Farid Pramani. Thank you.